What's up, Groovy Foodies? Today we are going to be stuffing something delicious in red tomatoes and turning into something magical with bacon. I'm Honeymoon and this is Hungry Happy Hippie. Oh, <gasps> let's get started. You can also use the same recipe with green tomatoes. You can use red tomatoes, green tomatoes, yellow tomatoes. Once you put them in the oven, they get roasted, the flavors come out, it's amazing. Also, if your tomatoes seem like they can't stand up on your own, that's what these lovely little borders are for. Leave them up against it, they need some support. Salt is a good way to bring out any sweetness and flavor. And next, we're gonna make the stuffing. And then we're going to do a little shimmy shake. Now we are just gonna fold these into each other. Old. All right, let's get our first tomato. This is about three fourths of a cup. It's okay, it just means it was too juicy to hang. But the great part about stuffed tomatoes, or anything stuffed actually, they already have that really yummy presentation, so you don't have to do much. So we are gonna garnish these with some bacon and some fresh chopped basil. And now it's time to add the bacon. Yum. Ooh, that's good bacon, y'all. Trader Joe's. All right, put a generous helping of bacon. And our extra crisp of bacon, you can snack on, throw into an omelet the next day. Whenever you make a little too much of an ingredient, just incorporate it into something else later. It's not the end of the world. But with bacon, oof, can never have too much bacon. So good. So these are stuffed red plump tomatoes from the garden. Dig in, groovy foodies, and enjoy. Let me know how you like it in the comments. 